Alrighty, so I'm gonna give like the fastest tutorial on earth on how to get mechanically good at this game, at least at aerials and stuff. Obviously, you're gonna have to do more stuff, like things actually involving the ball. But like literally, okay, this is called Obstacle Course 1, it's a workshop map, there's ways to get on Epic with Bacchus mod, whatever. You're gonna go through it in a bunch of different ways. All right. The first way is you're gonna always you're just gonna do it normally, but like you're, the front of your or the top of your car is always gonna be facing the camera, basically. All right. So you're gonna you're gonna do it like that. All right. Whole thing. Then the next way you're gonna do it to one side. All right. You're pretty much gonna have that one side facing your uh, your camera the entire time. <laughs> uh, and then you're also gonna do the entire thing with it facing the other way. All right. And who would have guessed the last way you're gonna do it you're gonna have it uh facing your camera but like the wheels right uh now now a time for the fun part so this one you're not allowed to use air roll you can do whatever right i recommend doing some like weird turns and stuff as well but like no air roll at all and you gotta go through it okay and then once you once you've done that you're going to do boost entire time so the entire time you're gonna hold down boost uh and go through every level like this uh, then for the next thing, you're going to hold air roll the entire time. You can also do air roll left the entire time and do both of those. I just did air roll right the entire time. So you're going to go through it, right? Air roll right the entire time. Uh, other things you can also do, uh, I, there's, there's more necessary parts, but like you can optional, op optionally do, uh, like holding a direction the entire time. Uh, I've, I've actually done this in multiple directions, but you can do each corner Right, like all like eight different like uh, cardinal directions or four, right? Just the corners, whatever, right? Uh, that will make it go. You'll you'll learn even faster. And then the final way, which is honestly the big point, and by far the most difficult thing, but by far will get you the most improvement. Uh, boost and arrow the entire time. Yeah, uh, this will take a long time to figure out, and I'm not consistent at it at all. I used to be a lot more consistent at it. I've done every level and it's doable all right it can be done it is annoying annoying right boost air roll entire time uh it will you'll you'll get you'll get mechanically better all right uh obviously you don't have to do it like consecutively but just do each each section uh with it uh but it will it is like i don't know it's 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 not easy right i will it's short and simple like i have no warm-up here so i'm terrible at it and i haven't really done this type of training for like a while because by the time i kind of figured out this i did it for like a week and then kind of quit the game because i got bored with it but it is uh i i i'll find some clips i'll dig up some clips of me doing these last two levels with it but i am screwing it up terribly right now because there's actually a reason for me to get it like immediately Wow, this is this is embarrassing. Okay, yeah, I've really fallen off from this game. If you could not tell, uh, but yeah, come on, come on. Okay, what? Well, I'm just not doing it. I'm just not doing it right right now. All right, it's not happening. Uh, but trust me, it works. It's a good thing to do. Uh, okay, that's all. I'm I'm rambling at this point. But if we survive the challenges we've set ourselves, we could potentially become the first species in the universe to create a structure with the scope of a star. If we do it, the only limitation left will be our own imagination. Discovered, people tried to tinker with it. In the 1960s, scientists bombarded plants with radiation to cause random mutations in the genetic code. The idea was to get a useful plant variation by pure chance, Sometimes it actually worked too. In the 70s, scientists inserted DNA snippets into bacteria, plants, and animals to study and modify them.